Hello. Today, we are going to watch a video showing how to do the beauty test in the lab. The beauty test is a traditional way to measure the strength of organic matter in water samples, and it is a very important parameter to determine water contamination by organics. Then what is beauty? The beauty stands for biochemical oxygen demand, and we use this to measure the strength of organic matter in water. Organics are major contaminants in wastewater, and a high concentration of organics in water can damage the aquatic ecosystem. With organics in water, oxygen will be consumed by microorganisms. So high organic concentration in water will cause oxygen depletion in the water. Those organics are complex, so it is difficult to determine their concentrations. And that is why we are using this oxygen demand to measure the degree of contamination by organics. In a closed system, the BOD will decrease over time due to oxygen consumption by microorganisms. The entire amount of BOD in the sample we call ultimate BOD or BODU. Also, we can show the oxygen consumption in water after a certain time what we call beauty T. We usually use beauty for five days or five day beauty. Today we're going to watch how to measure five day beauty in the lab. For the five day beauty test, we need to have a beauty bottle and the ohmmeter to measure dissolved oxygen concentration and an incubator to keep 20 degrees C for five days. And we need to prepare a dilution solution, especially for high strength water samples like wastewater. Dilution solution includes some nutrient supplement for microorganisms and other lab supplies for dilution. So this is a standard beauty bottle we use for the beauty test. The total volume of this bottle is 300 ml. And as you can see here, the shape of this lead is unique. This flared shape with this lead is designed for air, airtight seal in a traditional way because we don't want to have oxygen supplements from outside of this bottle. You can use water around here to prevent oxygen intrusion into the bottle during the test. This is a diometer we are going to use to measure dissolved oxygen concentration in water. This is a diopropyl. You can put this end into the water to measure dio concentration. And you can read numbers on display to check the dio concentration. And let's start. We are going to measure the initial dio concentration first. And here is the initial dio concentration we are going to use. And this is the dilution solution. And this is a wastewater sample we collected from wastewater treatment plant. And we are going to mix them in the beauty bottle. In this case, we added 5% of the wastewater sample into the bottle with the dilution solution. We are going to keep beauty bottles in the incubator for 5 days and temperature will be 20 degrees C. After 5 days, we measure dew concentration in the beauty bottle to see the changes in dew concentrations. And here's our results. 
then how we can calculate five-day BOD from our results. We need to have dissolved oxygen concentration before and after five days. And if you dilute the samples with dilution solution, you will need to divide the DO concentration changes by dilution factor P. You can calculate P based on your dilution factor and note that the total volume of sample is always 300 ml. For example, for the 5% dilution that we used here, the dilution factor P is 0 0.05. From our experiment, we got 9.40 mg per liter and 8.87 mg per liter after five days. So five-day BOD for our experiment is 10.6 mg per liter. However, we need to check first whether this BOD value is acceptable. We must have at least two mg per liter change in DO concentration, and the final DO concentration must be higher than one milligram per liter. Our, our result missed the second one, but we only got a 0 0.53 milligram per liter difference in DO concentration. So this beauty five value is not acceptable. The sample was too diluted in this case. So further exper experiments with less dilutions will be required to get acceptable beauty values. In today's video, we have learned about the beauty test and how we can do the beauty test in the lab to measure beauty in water samples. I hope this video will be helpful for your lab work. Thank you for watching.